chicken fighters were going to be feeling a little bad that, that they did let the lesh through. Like, is there, when, you, when you're playing these sort of games where a hero gets through, and let's assume they did, did you forget about it or just mis misread the draft? Like, how much does it hurt to play against this hero that you know inevitably you're just never going to have a good time against? Preston does go down and see, this is basically the same feeling as picking five strength heroes and not banning Timbersaw. This is kind of the yeah. feeling that they'll have, and unfortunately, this is the game, you know, life and death of lower division, you lose this, you walk out, so it's gonna Charlie. hit a little bit harder. It's just gonna change something. Charlie, can they keep him alive? They can't, Charlie's dead. They can't hold the sound, they've been able to bring down Blink and low skill, and Ducky the one. All right. They're, they're probably gonna be able to take down Ducky a second time here. Okay, he's got the BKB. He's gonna try and run aggressive. The kitchen's well. coming out as well. They've got to run. They can't deal with Ducky in the Charlie distance. Back They've got a triple kill. And Charlie's running, but Ducky's ready to chase him down. He picks up another. Can he get a rampage? He's not done yet. Rampage takes down the old double. Double. Oh. double rampage here for Ducky. There Looks like they may just back off, kill. perhaps wait for the next stage as this one fades in three seconds. They got a huge net worth advantage though, 13K. They're going to smoke immediately into the breach here as the Aegis leaves the hands of Gorg. See if that they they can find that fight whilst the Aegis is off. He's going to get that jump. Already tiny. He's in on the front. Tanner be separated off to the side. Stomp comes out. Found the stun there. the Gita Thug getting controlled here by the Rolling Thunder. They're still focusing down Tanner. Gorg moving in with the ult. Will take down the Enchantress. The other into the river. The jump's made onto Pablo. Thug with the BKB pot trying to chase down Gorg, but Gorg is able to kite him. He's stepping away from Thug. Now he's in Thug. Does get the ult off in time. He's got the ult. He's got the damage here. There's more tiny. He's falling low. Hot to the cheese. He plays out. Thug is he able to heal up? Oh, B! Malik! He's in! Just in time for the oh, kill! Five on him with a counter play! That's five! Another game-winning play. Last game, he was the man stealing that that, that shard, the ages and cheese whilst Team Bob were down. This game, he closes things up. Uh, they gotta get a smoke going Dying as soon as uh, Underlord and Leshrac are alive. You got the Kronos here. Maybe you can catch the backline, kill the Lina, kill the ET off or something, and play off that. The epileptic Kid, he's such a beast right now. He's got a Scotty, a lot of stats. Yeah, Scotty Aegis has a beautiful combo and he jumps the left track of the back lines. Iron Man stands no chance of surviving this engagement. Now an RP onto two, catch them out, skew all the way back. They've got mind control at the very least. Chrono Fear comes down for a miracle. Mind control still alive for the time being. They don't have the damage though. He actually gets disarmed inside the Chrono from the Conker. And now the yields is up onto the Lina. Lina in some trouble. Maybe she was like, I'm gonna say Anna's Naguna just before she goes down. Nicely done, just throwing out her spells. Meanwhile, that Magic Kid might be in a little bit too deep. A bye for mind control. He jumps back into the equation. Mage just gets popped from the anti-mage. Now where's the rest of the team? BBP, are they winning? They have no RP, they don't really have much, and the focus fight coming towards the anti-mage, anti-mage, he's on his side, but no! Cheese comes out, damage comes in, Miracle's actually the one who ends up dying here, and Epileptic just blinks himself away, as if nothing even happened. My control still in some trouble there, they might not be done, BBP, they're still going in. Beautiful Torrent catches out, Wee Wee is dead as well, 75 seconds. This might be the end of the game for Nygma. They have just thrown too much onto the fire, wow. now burning Rightly for the side of Virtus Pro Prodigy. What a play. GPK just passed, BKB walked on top of the anti mage, passed him the cheese. That anti mage was like one hit no away from dying when he got that cheese off. That was oh my god. Play right there. I mean, it's still Swift Blink forward. Swift Blink Abyssal. The root. They can force that BKB early, but we've got to be careful. Inside the rope, he pops the BKB. Army doesn't want to use it now, but the base of like, where's the extra support coming through? Team Liquid. Wait, Bob pump faking the ultimate. But the BKB wasted here from the troll. Still continuing, high ground is king. Need the vision, need the high ground. Trying to do. They were trying to do it in, when they were pushing the base, but they've managed to succeed around the Roche pit. No BKBs left on the key targets. They could actually just commit for the Roche with the Wukong, so they're gonna try and bail this out. Mars, pretty goddamn tanky. She can do the kick out, but the massive play! Queen Bot, who loses the Wukong to command, but up and terrorize Arme, he's in. Battle Trade Pop, do they have the extra control? Queen Bot trying to get a little bit of distance away, but Arme, he's locked on his target. Once again, Boxy, it's such an important ultimate, but it will not matter. Arena 
drop controlling liquid they lose them all buyback sports now keep it army reigns supreme he's gonna try and get the control make a nice call but the atos is there puck down and done with shin q triple kill an incredible fight there from the earth spirit they want more blood as well a massive fight for the roast pit but liquid these are a lot of diebacks coming out they're just feeding their life one after the other he's there for eighty max who jumps into the river there'll be a buyback from no tail Zion Puppy are they out without buy. buyback. Yeah. Can, can OG find something more from this? They, they found a third. They found Japsaw. They're outnumbering this them in three here. Man. OG is doing this. He gave him the cheese. They're doing it. He's popped it. He's popped the refresher shot. He's looking for a second chrono. He's going to drop it. Wants to take Mibon out. Knows that the spam ball back. Can he keep him No. The Fox is in with the save. The Decrypt find the life drain. Keeping Mibon healed up. He'll charge over with the stun. The silence. He's got Matty by Matty. He's got the BKB. The Satanic pops him. Turns over towards Mibon. Mibon will be saved again by Thompson with the Decrepify. Matty goes over towards him. Turns his attention back over towards Mibon. But no tell. He's healing Mibon up. Mibon's able to find the haste rune. He's on the run. Matthew's trying to chase. Jumps in with a time on. Mibon turns with another stun. Nisha. He's on top of Saxon. Mibon's seeing if he can get back and involved in the fight. But Yamsor. He's in with a forest strike. Number two. He jumps over to Thompson. Thompson turns with a decrepit fight. Matthew's still trying to come in. Thompson goes out with a flick on the side. Mibon jumps in with a stun. Matthew, he wants to go for more. They've got the control with the X mark on him. Mibon. He's going to be He's able to go back into the BKB. Looks towards Nisha. Nisha sneaks away with his own Glimmer There's a silence. It's on to Matthew. Loads of song. Removes the silence. Sets up for the catch. Play the stun. Matthew. He does. Sees Danny. But again, the Decrypt by the Yours. He's set up for the air. Yapsel's in with the epicenter. He's taken out Mibon. They've taken down No Tail. Tops in his head. Secret. They're hard on the trail. The little piggy. The flicker won't help him now. He turns. He's caught out by the burn strike. The he's trying to run. <laughs> he's up once more with the Yours. But Secret. They've the got him again. He's out, he's away. Thompson will manage to live, but the damage has been done. They managed to force the meta, so they can just kind of reset and wait for that meta to go away. Please wait. <laughs> Are they gonna wait though? They don't want he sees the opportunity to be able to catch the bat rider, force that magic lamp, all the little things that help save always want to fly, limp away. The illusions have been dealt with, though. The damage running low on Fly to Moon as they fail to be able to repel OG. That's going to be Elena Barracks. But they didn't wait because the meta was already out. I didn't realize he popped it that early on in the fight. Yeah. Now it just keeps on jumping in. Midwan sees an opportunity. Oh. Like the smoke screen catches Riceberg right as he goes for the jump betting, but pops the Minotaur horn. Does manage to get the toss back. Bashed up, though. Telekinesis does the last for long. Hook shot one. Cox push back a four step. And he managed to get off the cheese. I'm saying, and now the RP into the ground. Oh, oh, so beautiful. Thompson, he'll finish it up in style. They have a couple of buybacks, but only two for Fly to Moon. And it's looking like OG with that kind of sick wombo combo may have just ended this series. Yeah, you couldn't even see the individual beams of the Cataclysm. They're all right on top of each other. It just looked like one ray of absolute death. As they used all the calls. Geez. They're they, not even going to try. They showed signs of life. Justify the definitely in the best place it was like we we need to kill that. They go on us. If I get jumped, we have no save whatsoever. They have the BKB, so I won't be able to save people with the terror eyes. I get it. It's a risk. He's got the setup in. Unless he's able to find Fabian on his way back to the base. Fabian's come back. Arbe have to pump the cheese. The Prince come in from Arbe, but Arbe he's been ruptured. Only Thunder will hold back on. He's even having a diving in the super dogs out. I'm able to put the big heavy get up to the high ground. Hook turns. He'll have to stand first. Cross is still in RP. Chasing off. Looking towards him. Oh, the super dogs are just going to be able to patch him. It's out like this. Back in range of it. Are they dead for over a minute? Panichi, they're not done. They're going over towards their fingers and chasing down the death bomb in the pit. We'll push back the two of them. As well, separating him from nothing to say. But RP is ready to dip back in with a little bit of speed. Nothing to say goes down. Why also falls three dead on PSG LGD. Now they're just diving. Buys back, but I don't think they can get any kills on this. Right beyond, on a jump board, I'll bet. A bit of mana to plug around with. The roll up, they found keeps himself. Pretty crazy. That's horrifying sound. Yeah, it's pretty cool, actually. I, I saw it a couple of times now in some pubs. Sample God, the Aegis, and the Cheese on the high ground. The question is. Does Humble God want to actually finish the game, or does he want to keep farming up, you know, heroes? He got the tier. He got the tower. Now it's time to go. No, for he's just chasing sure. after Spartan. He's like, all right, there's not going to be any of these saves going on. Down you go. There's no buyback on him. Go for the stampede. He's running right into the fountain yet again. He wants Dominan. 
And he's got all the illusions. It's a good stun, though, here coming out for Focus. And you have to remember, he does have a Rapier. So that is going to be the Aegis going down. They've got ways to lock him down. They have to be quick about it. Nice silence, though, coming out from Socks. buys a little bit more time. Anna gets dominant again. So should be able to go clean up Wish. And he's like, hmm, I see there's a Rapier here. I would like that, but, you know, we'll focus over here onto Wish. Does have to be careful. Nice stop coming out from Set and then follow up with Socks. Down goes Stomanen. They want this. They want to get as many kills as they can get here. Wish trying to run away. Can't run very far because it is, of course, his own fountain. Meanwhile, but the Thompson. creeps are just winning the game for them while all of this is going down. The GG, GG. gets called. Humble God, have mercy as OG. They're looking up real nice now with Ana back on the squad. Yeah, there's a backup from Fishman who has come in to back off and bring out the Thugita Lifestealer. But back into the pit, Malik's dead. Roshan's going to be ready for Team Bolt to clean up. As they'll pick it all up themselves. Who we got the Axe going to? Axe going to, to Gorg by the looks of it. Taking the cheese as well. He's edited double cheese. Yeah, there we go. I mean, the Gorgonzola special here. Do <laughs> 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 like that one? <laughs> Sorry, it's a little bit cheesy. Anyway, let's. Uh... <laughs>